Welcome to the new ACTO website. I'm going to briefly show you how you will register your most important information for us. So you start on the home page and then you go to membership and select membership registration. As you see, you get two choices here and you have to make a choice. It is important to do I am registering as an existing member because that gives you all the fields we need right now. Registering as a new member, you would have to fill everything right now, but we are on holding off on that uh, for a little bit, and we will ask you to do that now when you renew. So getting the right level is really important. So select professional number, member. If you know your membership number, fill it in. Because this new um, software could not work with our old numbers, everybody will get a new membership number. And that's the one you will have to remember from now on. So if you don't know your old number, that's fine. Uh, fill in your name, last name, street name, and number, of course. Um, down, zip code, and here you're going to choose your country. If you click on it, you see the empty bar here. If you start with a few letters, it will quickly give you the option of the country you need, and you just click on that one, and you're done. Email address. Now, this is really important, uh, because if you pick an address here, that's already registered. So I'm going to pick one that's, oops, I can't spell my own name. I'm picking one here that is already registered and I'm going to show you in a minute what happens when you do that. If you are getting the message you are already registered, please do not change it to another email address. This means you're already on the system and you'll have to input your information in another way. So please contact us if this happens and do not fill in the form. Now, I'm not giving you my number, so that's some nonsense. Uh, what we really do want to know is your current professional membership body information. That's important for us that that's current. So just fill in yours and the date that it expires. You can change the year here like this. You can change the months this way and then click on the number and you see you're done. If you know your membership number, that will be great. Um, if not, that can wait. It is important for us to have the declarations here and this one is mandatory, so please fill in no yes 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 now i'm going to try and save and let's see what happens submit it did not take me out of the form if that happens you know something is not right do not leave the page if this happens because if you leave the page now everything will be lost so we're going to scroll down and see what was wrong this email address is already linked to an existing account. Now, I knew that was going to happen. So I am just going to change it to some nonsense here. I'm going to scroll down again. I'm going to see what happens now. Submit. See, it has taken me out of the form. When that happens, you know it's OK. Uh, we've got your information, we will process you and you will get an email letting you know that everything is in order.